Hey, let me show you something interesting. I've created uh, a couple of different events here in my Homeseer system that are designed to speak, but each event will actually speak with a different voice. Here's an, an alert, for example, uh, that alerts that the garage door is still open. Oh dear, it's after midnight and the garage door is still open. Please close it when you get a moment. I'm using um, the Millie voice, Capstral Millie. Here's another alert about motion being sensed on the patio. Motion has been sensed on the patio. And that is Allison, Capstral Allison. I have uh, another event that announces tea time. Excuse me, sir, but it's now four o'clock and time for afternoon tea. Shall we take a break? And I've got another event that whispers and reminds the kids that it's bedtime. And then finally, I have another event that's an intruder warning. Warning. You are not authorized to leave this area. We have no will call the police. Now, the way that this works is, first of all, you've got to have a home seer system that is based on Windows. So it can be one of our Home Troller S6 units, or you can be running a copy of our HS3 or HS3 Pro software on your own PC. But the way to set this up, first of all, is you'll need to have the voices themselves. These voices are available in our online store. Go to the store, and uh, right now, I guess the easiest way to get there is to click on home, go down the category listing on the left, choose voices, find the Kepstral voices, and then a listing of them will be here. Uh, there's 18 different voices to choose from. Pick the ones that you want, add them to your cart, and go ahead and make the purchase. Once you have finished the purchase, you'll get a, a little license program that you can run on your home seer system and you'll be able to download the voices. You can actually download the voices directly from this page in our online store. You switch over to your home seer system, like so, and home seer is running here. Uh, you'll be able to, once you've installed them, you'll be able to see the voices by going to your Windows control panel, clicking on the speech recognition control panel, and then clicking text to speech. When you get into the text-to-speech uh, screen, there's a voice selection menu up top. Just take a quick look at it and make sure that your voices have properly installed. As you can see from this, I have Kepstrel, Allison, Damien, Duncan, Lawrence, Millie, and Shouty and Whispery. So all of those are different voices. Now, if I were to select one of these, uh, for, for example, Lawrence, and then click Apply, that would make Lawrence the default voice for all of the spoken announcements of my home seer system. I'm going to leave that set to the default, which is Microsoft Anna, um, and I'm just going to leave that part alone. Anyway, you just need to make sure that you've got the voices installed here. Once the voices are installed, then you can switch back to your home seer system and you can create the necessary events. The events can be triggered on anything you want. For each event that you want to speak, just add um, the action of speak something. And then in the text field, you need to put this very important in brackets, um, voice required equals, and then in quotes, name equals, and then the actual name of the voice. Now, if you're confused about the name of the voice, again, you can go back to your home seer system click on text-to-speech again, and the name is going to be here. It's going to be Capstral Lawrence, Capstral Duncan, so on and so forth. So make sure that you properly identify it here in the Home Seer event action. And then after that, you can type in the precise uh, phrase that you want to be spoken. And really, that's all you need to do. Once that's done, make any adjustments to the phrase that you need to to make it sound good. If you want to test it, just click on the little run button up top. Oh dear, it's after midnight and the garage door is still open. Please close it when you get a moment. And that's how it works. Pretty quick, pretty simple, um, but it's a, it's a great way to add uh, a lot of personality to your home seer system and to kind of mix things up a little bit. <laughs>